So we're going to write a microservice. The job of this microservice will be to act as a queue for sending email. The actual sending of the email will be done using a third-party service, but tracking the state of an email is something that we'll want to do ourselves. So this service is kind of like a stateful proxy for that external email service. Now this mailer service has two major parts of functionality. The first is its very own REST API that will be usable by our other microservices. And the second is a background task system that will shepherd an outgoing email through some other service. And we're going to write this service using Ruby on Rails. It'll make a good demonstration of having various languages working together, which is one of the strengths of building your applications this way. Ruby on Rails makes it really easy and fast to spin up a new application. And it has a subset that works really well for writing a REST API. Now, if you don't like Ruby on Rails, there are literally hundreds of options for you to write a service like this. Now, since we're using Ruby on Rails, our background task system will be based on Rescue. Rescue uses Redis for its queue, so we'll be spinning up a Redis service also. Rescue makes it really easy to enqueue a background task, and its default error handling is just about right. The task worker can run the same image as the one initiating the task, which makes it easy to fix a problem in both places if there is one. Now, there are several other background task managers for Ruby. Some of the others include Sidekick, Delayed Job, Beanstalk D, and there are several others as well. For the service we use to send email, we'll use Mailgun. Mailgun has packaged up its API inside of RubyGem, which makes it really easy to use from Rails. And it has an extensive feature set as we get more sophisticated with email. There are a lot of alternatives in this space. Some of them are Mandrill, SendGrid, Postmark, and there are many others. So that's it. Our base layer will be Ruby on Rails. We'll use that to serve up our REST API. We'll use Rescue as a background task queue to send emails through Mailgun. In our next video, we'll take a look at the code for this microservice.